Hi, I'm Sherry from Whole Circle Studio and welcome to our ninth Around the World Block of the Month destination. This month we're traveling to Paris, France. In this video, I'm going to share tips to help you piece your block. This month's block features the Eiffel Tower, an iconic symbol of Paris. The tower was built by Gustave Eiffel for the 1889 Universal Exposition, which was to celebrate the 100th year anniversary of the French Revolution. Here's a fun fact. The Eiffel Tower was only intended to last for 20 years. In addition to this video, please be sure to refer to the tips in the pattern, as well as other links below, including some foundation paper piecing video tutorials and previous month's videos. Let's get started. This month's block is pretty straightforward and comes together like many of the previous Around the World blocks. Be sure to match the dots when joining the paper pieces. This will ensure that everything in this symmetrical tower stays aligned and centered. Just a reminder that using super thin pins makes this task easier. I'll put a link to the ones I like below. There are some skinny strips in this block. Be sure to just take your time, go slow, and press in the direction indicated in the pattern. Like we did with the Tokyo block, if you're making the throw quilt, you'll want to wait to complete the Paris block until you're ready to assemble the entire quilt top. This is called out in the pattern. You'll want to set aside the top portion of the block and the bottom portion of the block. Otherwise, you'll need to deal with partial seams when assembling the quilt top. If you just can't wait to see your block assembled, you can join the two pieces with a long stitch on your sewing machine. This is also considered a basting stitch. I would recommend a stitch length of about a 5.0 or whatever the longest stitch is available on your sewing machine. That way, when you're ready to assemble your quilt top, you can remove the long stitches and you're ready to go. I can't wait to see your Eiffel Tower blocks come together. Thanks for being here and for sewing along with us. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. And also be sure to share your progress on Instagram using the around the world hashtags found in the pattern. So that way we can check out what you're working on. See you next month and happy sewing.